for flexonline.com or in Columbus, Ohio for the 25th anniversary of the Arnold Classic. It's 2013. And uh, I think it's kind of very forfeiting that uh, it's the 25th anniversary, you know, this great event. It's 25 years ago where, um, you know, our kind of boss, Rich Gaspari, took that title for the very first time. And um, I think what's amazing for us, especially as a team, is Rich is going to be actually honoured and uh, presented with a Lifetime Achievement Award by Arnold this weekend. Um, and it kind of seems like sort of surreal, iconic for all of us because, you know, I kind of grew up in the era of uh, Rich Gaspari, Sean Ray, Lila Brada, um, you know, sort of um, Lee Haney, you know, these guys are younger than me, but these, that was an amazing era for me. You know, Kenny's 14 weeks away from uh, his pro debut. Um, sort of nearly two years ago, he won his uh, pro card in the North Americans where I traveled out to stay with him, his beautiful wife, Nikki. Um, I predict some really good things, you know, some very promising things for Ken, because I would say Ken's like a physique of a, like a Flex Wheeler and a Dexter Jackson all rolled into one. You know, full muscle bellies. Um, you know, he's definitely made some phenomenal improvements in his physique uh, since stepping on stage. You know, the areas that we really wanted to concentrate was chest and his arms. Definitely areas of which have come back up, or certainly come up, I should say, and, and, and the thickness and the development that he's brought as a whole to his physique Zeke is really, really fantastic. Um, and it's great for us, as I said, because when we get the chance to train to e with each other, you know, there's a lot of sort of like, uh, you know, support and uh, motivation and we have the crack, you know, there was, there's never a dull moment with us guys. So anyway, I'll let Kenny sort of have a quick chat and um, he can tell you a little bit about himself and where he's going now in 40 weeks time. Ken Jackson uh, from Detroit, Michigan. And uh, like I said, Neil said I'm 14 weeks out from the Toronto Pro, which is May 28th. Um, the last year kind of took off since 2011. Uh, wife got pregnant, she had a baby girl, and we named her Jade. So I've been dealing with that, but it's been a nice relaxed. Um, I, I got some balance in my life. I think that's why I made so much improvement. Neil kind of taught me that the last time he was in town in 2011 that I needed to balance. He said I would be a way better bodybuilder if I would just learn to balance everything, not think about training or not thinking about bodybuilding when I'm not doing you know, bodybuilding. So uh, I think it's, it's, it's helped me a lot, um, and that's why I've made such great improvement, and I look forward to uh, bringing a different package uh, in about 14 weeks. I made, I put on the size, so now it's about, to br it's about bringing uh, conditioning. So Neil's pounding in my head, conditioning, conditioning, conditioning. So we're not worried about how much I weigh on stage. We're not worried about how big I am. We're just worried about like how I can get like flex. Hey guys, Sean Barber, Y3T, Team Gaspari athlete. Um, it's such an honor to be a part of uh, Y3T and Team Gaspari right now, especially to see where they have, you know, how far they have come. Uh, Y3T and Team Gaspari, as Neil was saying, um, it, it's it, it's just it's it's awesome the last couple of years to see how the team has grown and how close they've come together. It's great to be able to get together with these guys. Hey, Flex Online again. Uh... Flex Lewis here, I appreciate again all the support, I always keep on saying it by these guys, but uh, I really do appreciate everything uh, that uh, that you guys send me, and these guys next to me, and what can I say about them, you know, Sean is my, my uh, long time training partner, um, I've just moved so I'm missing this guy tremendously, but having come off the shows that I did last year, we both took uh, about two months off the gym, so it's the first time today that I've actually seen Sean and, and how much that uh, he's grown in the last couple of weeks since starting his uh, off-season prep, so very proud of this guy and all the principles he's falling through, Neil, and, and uh, Kenny Jackson over there, phenomenal improvements. Again, I've seen that guy win his pro card um, and in North Americans, and, and you, you watch this space, guys, he's not going to look anything like... Uh, it's going to be chalk and cheese compared to what he looked like on stage. He nails that conditioning. He's going to be a top runner for that show, and, and that's my prediction. So, Anyway, have a great time, guys, and uh, this is checking out in uh, 